Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. You don't hear that little ch ch ch, -ch anymore. Because last video I noticed that because I'm holding my phone bad and crap. So yeah. I'm just gonna be showing you which maps you should try to black border with chimps first. Now obviously this should be a beginner map. Uh, there's there's no there's no choosing that. Um but which beginner map? I recommend Starting on cubism, because it's pretty fun. And overall, well, hope you. And <clears throat> the hardest modes will probably be half cash, alternate balloon rounds, and popple and chips. And maybe a popolips would be hard. The other ones are pretty easy. Deflation could be a challenge for you, but cubism is a nice fun map to start with. That's where I've got my first live order in. Even have that this has a black border in co-op because I wanted to get one with my friend. Second map, probably logs. Um it's kind of a boring map, but it's pretty easy to black border. If you want some fun map, I also recommend doing resort. Really easy. You can just like place a tax shooter in that little corner thing in the resort map. Um other maps are just normal maps. Um Four circles is pretty easy. There's so many lanes. End of the road is pretty fun. Just whatever map you want. It should probably be a beginner map. I recommend trying to get at least like ten beginner maps before you start. I mean, not ten, like five chimps and beginner maps. To then you can start trying to get chimps in intermediate. Basically, like beat five chimps mode in each mode before moving on to the next one. And expert maps, uh, you need, we really need to be an expert. It must like Dark Castle. Dark Castle is really easy. I recommend actually playing this mode on hard and playing on standard. You should get yourself like a free 800 cash. It's super easy. This map is really easy. And pretty fun. So, yeah. That's the end of my video. Hope this helps you, uh, some new players out. Um, a hero I recommend using is actually Quincy. Uh, it's free, you don't need to worry about getting monkey money. Um, Quincy's a nice starter tower. If you know you use magic monkeys a lot, like druids and wizards and stuff, Obin's good. Um, for new players, Sada's good, she's really cheap, uh, does a lot of work. Um, you know, NTN's good if you don't really know how to use heroes, I mean, villages and stuff. And other towers, I mean other heroes, is if you just know how to use them. <coughs> but I recommend starting with these two because they're pretty sure they're free. I don't know if this guy's. The, I don't know who's free and who's not because I've been playing this game for too long. But yeah, Quincy's probably the, the best one. He does really good early game. Falls off a little bit early game, but yeah. Another fun thing to do for you new players is doing the daily challenges. They <coughs> are challenged, but. For new players, this could be fun. You can learn some new tower mechanics. That's really useful when you start getting the harder maps. You need to learn these new challenges. For advanced maps, I, if you're a new player, don't do this. Uh, they could be really hard. Uh, if anything, just search up how to do it. Uh, there's some channels on YouTube that show <coughs> people how to beat them. Especially this one. This actually could give you 400 monkey money because of the, the map. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, uh, and yeah, peace out.